What's going on, y'all? Welcome back to Game Reviews TV. It's Nephew, this Dragon Ball Kakarot. We have a new update. 1.04 is now available. You can download it now on your PS4. It's about 2.6 gigabytes. That's what the file is. It's pretty big, if you ask me. Now, this isn't the one that's supposed to add the time machine where you can revisit the old mission. So, unfortunately, that's not this one, guys. But this one will fix a few nasty issues and improve the load times. Now, you know that the load times might not be that much noticeable, so, you know, it is what it is. But, you know, when, you, when you're when loading from game stream, the game screen, you're going from loading screens, it is kind of, it does take kind of a while to load. So, it is kind of unbearable to me. So, at the same time, this will be able to fix that for you. So, go ahead and download the patch. So, I'm going to read the patch notes for you. Dragon Ball Z, say patch notes. All right, so, reduce load times when traveling from one area to another. Issue where players were unable to accept the sub-story telekine telekinesis training, say in Arc Episode 3, if they saved and loaded their saved data after fighting Tien. Issue that caused the main story icon to not be displayed if you save and load your saved data after clearing the main story the longest three hours, say in Arc Episode 5. An issue where Chi-Chi cannot be found on the field if you accept the sub-story Goten's growth. This is in Boo's Arc Episode 1 and clear the main story without completing the sub story. Then the last issue is uh, one that caused characters related to the main or sub story to not appear if that specific character is already found within the field as a villainous enemy. All right, so these, uh, these pretty much basically just patched up a couple bugs that people were finding. Obviously, they have been complaining about different, thing, different things. I know a couple more bugs that I, I probably need to let them know about that I have ran into um some sound bugs and some some things that was happening to it but at least they starting to patch up um a lot of the things that's wrong with the game and that's kind of a really good thing and i'm glad that they're working on the loading screen time because that's really really sucks that we have you know have to wait for that load like that but anyway i hope you find this video informative i'm gonna put the patch notes in the description so you can just read them yourself and also, I'm going to leave a link to the description where you can, um, you know, see the source where I got the patch notes from. And also, make sure you hit that like button, guys. Make sure you hit that subscribe button and drop a comment below. Let me know if you uh, like the game so far and if you having fun with it. I'm having fun with the game. Did you beat the game yet? I did. So let me know, guys. All right. Talk to you later. Peace. You can destroy entire planets, but you can't take down one single person. What are you? You mean you haven't figured it out yet?